hi my loves welcome back to the stars cartel channel if you don't know i am star the scripture god sent me to is first chronicles 18 after this david defeated the philistines and subdued them and he took gath and its towns away from the control of the philistines he also defeated moab and the moabites became his subjects paying tribute so here's the message for somebody God said the victory is going to fall into your hands. The victory is going to be given to you. This is someone you are concerned about certain things. You may have different things going on right now. It's probably like I just feel like this is for somebody. It's not just one issue. You don't have just one situation where you're just concerned about this one thing and you're concerned about this other thing. I even feel like this is for someone Typically, you don't stand and fight. You you don't like fighting. You don't like arguing. And, you know, in reality, you see that you are the one who is innocent in situations that you are in. God said, if you would just sit still and stop running, you would receive the victory. The only reason that you have not received victory in the past is because you bow out gracefully. And that's fine. It's nothing wrong with that. But God said this time you're not bowing out. He don't want you to bow out because you are not wrong. You are the like you are the victim. You the victim. People, I just feel like people keep messing with you. People keep coming after you. People keep attacking you. God said, uh-uh, no more of that. They're going to leave you alone. And you will receive the victory in this matter. Because you didn't do anything wrong. You don't deserve to be being treated the way that you are being treated. You have not done anything for uh to receive the treatment that you are receiving right now. You don't you you don't deserve that. And God said he is giving you the victory. You don't even have to do anything except not run. Like, this <laughs> is... I just feel like it's somebody you just want to run away so bad. That's what you want to do. You you just want to just, just, just disappear. Just how in that, uh, in the episode of The Simpsons where Homer disappears into the bushes. You just want to faint. You just want to gradually get up out of there. God said, no, uh-uh, mm-mm. He said he didn't put a fence in front of the bushes so you can't disappear. No, you're not going nowhere. Stay right there and you 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 deal with it. God says you will win this one. You 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 should have won the other ones. But the only reason you didn't win is because you left. And by default it went to somebody else. God says, No, not this time. You did you have no reason to be running. You have no reason to be scared. You know, you have no reason to be feeling as though you have already lost. God says this is not, the battle is not yours. You don't even have to do anything in the battle. You don't even have to fight anybody. So that's the message. God said don't run nowhere. And, and, and that's it, okay? This is the scripture. At the beginning of the scripture, it says David's victories. You are winning this. And that's the end of it. That's the message. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Deuce.